आई एम भवानी शंकर असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर ऑफ केमिस्ट्री सारुख पत्री बॉयज डिग्री कॉलेज मीठी थरपारकर टुडे वी हैव अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक ऑफ फर्स्ट ईयर केमिस्ट्री चैप्टर नंबर सेवन दी ऑक्सीडेशन एंड रिडक्शन रिएक्शन सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी हैव टू डिफाइन दिस टू दैट हाउ ऑक्सीडेशन रिएक्शन टेक्स प्लेस एंड हाउ रिडक्शन रिएक्शन रिएक्शन टेक्स प्लेस एज यू नो दी ओवरऑल jointly we call it as redox reaction so in this uh, part of the topic what we have to first look into that the oxidation reaction so the oxidation reaction is that in which electrons are lost by the atom molecule or ion and we have the examples of those uh, in the first one as you know we have iron atom and as you know iron atom which can lose two electron in the first phase and it will be converted into ferrous ion and if with certain reagent it is further to be reacted and to be converted from ferrous to ferric ion means we have a further loss of electron and as we have also the example of chloride ion that is we have negative ion other than those positive ions which are to be converted further into more positivity but in a negative ions we can also uh, this uh, oxidation takes place and there also the electrons are to be lost like uh, in this case we have chloride ions and chloride ions on loss of one electron each and you know uh, to be converted into neutral form of chlorine chloride ion uh, it is chlorine molecule so these three are the examples in which we have the finding of oxidation where the electrons are lost by the atom then by the positive ion by the negative ion and as you know this type of chemical reaction when takes place means oxidation takes place then we have on the other side definitely we have a simultaneous change that is you know uh, the gain of electron so we have another term for that it is called reduction reaction so in the reduction reactions are those chemical reactions in which electrons are gained by the atom molecule or ions so we can also express it uh, by giving example as you know we have a molecule of chlorine so chlorine molecule can gain electron and you know each chlorine atom can gain one electron so we have a chlorine molecule so that's why we have to uh, put a coefficient two and it is to be converted into chloride ion and uh, in certain chemical changes what happen if we have a presence of a salt which contain ferric ion and those ferric ions can also gain one electron and to be converted into ferrous ion and jointly if you we can express it in that manner that we have a chemical reaction as whole like the reaction between hydrogen and bromine so we have hydrogen molecule and bromine molecule so when these two are reacting by addition then the product obtained like hydrogen bromide and if we have to check the chain and then you can have a finding that is from hydrogen which is neutral molecule bromine as a neutral molecule and after the chemical chain means after the uh, addition after the combination of the two molecules we have a product called hydrogen bromide so now in hydrogen bromide if you have to check the oxidation number then you can have the finding that hydrogen it is you know in this compound possesses the oxidation state of plus 1 and you know the bromine as minus 1 so now we can overall express this redox reaction in that way that hydrogen as you know after the loss of electron it is converted into hydrogen plus 1 that is you know we can say this is oxidized in this reaction hydrogen is oxidized whereas you know bromine uh after the reaction it is converted into bromide ion so what happened that 
we have the decrease in the charge. So we can also the dimension of expression is that either we have to say loss of electron, gain of electron, or oxidation and reduction. On the other side, if you uh, we have to express this reaction in that way, we have the uh, increase in charge from reactant side to the product side, and if we have a decrease in the charge from reactant side to a product side. That is called reduction. So in this case as well, we have chemical reactions in that hydrogen and bromine. They are reacting, and as you know, when we are getting a product uh, like hydrogen bromide, in that we can also have the finding that the charge is you know uh, increase in our hydrogen and you know decrease in bromine. So in this case, we can say hydrogen is oxidized while bromine is uh, reduced. So that's we have the uh, today's very uh, short small topic, but it is very important for the next topic which we have to study, and that is we have the balance of equation uh, by uh, balance of equation of redox reaction and in by ion electron method. So that's we have to check to the next time. Thanks.